Happy Thursday, everyone. I hope you have a wonderful day. Today, I'm turning this beautiful piece of Purple Heart. This piece was sent to me by a fellow named Justin. He asked me to turn him a bowl out of it. So it's such a great honor to be able to turn such a beautiful piece of wood. I really enjoyed this turn. Um, the finish turned out absolutely amazing beautiful on this. The Axe Abrasive Sanding Paste and Polishing Paste really made this purple heart pop. So you will have to stick around to the end to see the final results of this. You're going to love it. I want to share just a little bit of what I did over the weekend. I'm telling you what, I had the most amazing time of my life. This organization puts on this, it's called the Firewood Hoarders Club, and they have this every year, and they call it the G2G. It's where they go around and they cut firewood for um, lower income and um, elderly folk. If, if anybody that I met over the weekend is watching that, you can correct me in the comments below. I'd greatly appreciate that. I'm not exactly sure if I got that correct. Um, but it was an absolutely extraordinary time. I got to meet some really amazing people and I got to stay in a beautiful state. I'm telling you what, Pennsylvania, you have it going on. Your state is gorgeous and I can't wait till the next time I get to stay there again. I had an amazing time. Um, we stayed at the Sportsman's Club and it, it's, um, I mean, I got the paper here. It is the, sorry, I knew I should have had it ready, but I didn't, so bear with me. It's, uh, it's by the Blair County Game, Fish, and Forestry, and it's a sportsman's club. And I'm telling you what, it's in Altoona, Pennsylvania, and they have a, it's like a hidden gem in the in the middle of the woods. It, this place is just absolutely stunning, and I am so glad I got to be part of such a great cause. Um, they cut the firewood for this place because it's all volunteer work there, so it's it was just it, it, total privilege to be able to be part of that. I didn't get to do as much as I wanted to while I was there. I did do a little bit of splitting and stuff, but I was just trying to get the feel for what they all do because I plan on going to as many of these as I possibly can because I had an amazing time. So that's what I did this weekend. Share what you did in the comments below. I'd, I'd love to hear what you did over the weekend as well. All right, guys, don't forget to give me that like, subscribe, and comment let me know what you think all right guys enjoy this video and don't forget to stick around and look at those glam shots at the end you're gonna really love this bowl all right enjoy This purple heart is turning out to be absolutely gorgeous, but with that come some challenges as well. You'll notice me switching out my tools quite a bit. I, I go from my bowl gouges to the hunter tools, and then I'll even switch off to my woodpecker tool. That's because I'm getting a better cut on this piece of wood with the hunter tools than I was with my bowl gouge. And sometimes you run into that when you are turning. You know, your bull gouge is good for certain things and your carbide is good for certain things. So you just gotta play around with your tools and find what works best for that project. Because you might have all bull gouges and find yourself in this predicament where, okay, well I need something different because this is just not working. And that's where sometimes carbide comes in handy because it does give you that cut that you're looking for in your pieces. So that's why I like to switch my tools off and on because I'm getting the results that I'm looking for. I started sanding at 80 grit and went through all the grits clear up to 400. I have a 
little bit of liner cracking in the rim of this bowl. I'm not too concerned about it, but I do want to fill it in. So I'm using Starbond Heavy Thin and some shavings. Once I'm done and I'm happy with uh, how I filled it, then I'll follow up with the accelerator. If you're interested in trying a CA glue, and I'm not talking just heavy thin, I'm talking brown, black, heavy, medium, thin, odorless, they have it. They have all the glues for your projects. All you have to do, if you wanna save some money, is click that video description below. There is a coupon code in there. Please feel free to use that. Save yourself a little bit of money. I am trying to get a hold of Starbond to get that percentage up to 15%. I think I'm like the only one on YouTube that is offering 10%. So I've been trying to get a hold of them to get uh, more of a savings for my viewers and my subscribers. So. I hope that I can get a hold of them maybe for the next video so I can get that 15% for everybody. But right now, I, all I can offer is 10%. I, I really hope that you guys are using my coupon codes. I would greatly appreciate that. As a wood turner, my favorite part of a project that I'm working on is putting the finish on and my go-to finish is Axe Abrasive Sanding Paste and Polishing Paste. With this product I not only get a great finish, I achieve this beautiful glass-like finish on my pieces. I don't have to worry about fingerprints, smudges, or anything like that. It is just an absolute all-around great product. If you're interested in trying Axe for yourself, I can save you 15% off. All you have to do is click that video description below, find the link for Axe, enter coupon code TANYA15 at checkout, save yourself a little bit of money, and you're getting a great product and finish all in one. All right, guys, we made it to the end. I hope you enjoyed this video. Justin, thank you so much for this opportunity to, to work with such a beautiful piece of wood and to create you a, a beautiful bowl out of this piece. I really hope you like it. I will get it in the mail as soon as possible. If you guys like this video, don't forget to smash that like button. Leave me a comment and let me know what you think of this bowl and let me know what you did over the weekend. And if you're new to my channel, please consider subscribing and hit that notification bell so you never miss out on any of my videos. I post a new video every Thursday at 7 a.m. And it would be a truly an honor to have you join me every Thursday. All right, guys, until next week, I will see you. Take care. God bless. Goodbye.